Hi, it's Alex. I'm recording in a new spot today for Variety. Today I want to talk about a concept that I see thrown around a lot in our society that I think is not a very good way of thinking about things. And that is the idea of selfishness, or being self-centered, being a bad thing. Um, when I was growing up, I had people in my life who would sometimes accuse me of being selfish, in particular in response to me not doing things that they wanted me to do. So I'd be like, it'd be like, oh, can you help me with this? And then I wouldn't do it, and they'd be like, oh, you're really selfish, like you're just thinking about yourself, blah blah blah, things like that. I don't think that's a very healthy way of interacting with people. I think one thing that helped me realize the problem with this was being on an airplane and seeing the little safety brochure where it, it talks about what to do in an emergency, and it talks about oxygen masks, and it says, you know, in the case of the oxygen masks coming down, put the mask on yourself first before you try to put the mask on someone else. And the reason is really practical. If you have a kid or something right next to you, you put the mask on them first, well, you might pass out and die. Whereas, if you put the mask on yourself first, the kid might not have oxygen, but once you get the oxygen going, then you can help them. And I think that's a great analogy for life. I think that it's really important, if you really want to be a generous person, if you want to help others, if you want to have the biggest positive impact on others in the world, it's really important to take care of yourself first. Because if you're in a good place, you will be much more able to help others than if you're not in a good place. And I've seen this over and over again. I've seen examples of where someone is sort of not getting their own needs met, and then they try to do something for someone else, they do a kind of half-assed job of it, and in some cases they might even do it out of a sense of obligation and then feel resentful towards the other person. And sometimes expressing that resentment can be really toxic, and it can hurt someone a lot more than the, the favor that they did for them actually helped them. And I've kind of been on both ends of this, so I'm speaking from experience here. Uh, so, how does this relate to selfishness? I think when people talk about selfishness and say like, oh, this person's being selfish, it's a whole paradigm that's problematic. And it's a paradigm that says that kind of people are inherently bad, and they're inherently just trying to help themselves, and they don't care about others, and so you need to kind of discipline yourself, like, control your own wants and desires in order to help other people. And that's a complete opposite of how I think about it. I tend to see people as inherently generous, and I think that if people take care of themselves first, they'll be in a good place, a place of contentment, and a place where they have excess resources, and where they can use those resources to help others. So, I want to call on people to consider removing the concept of selfishness from your dialogue. I think it's something that is typically thrown around as an insult or an accusation on people when someone's frustrated with their behavior. So, if someone's not giving me what I want, instead of being like, oh, that person's being really selfish, I would rather be like, hey, what's going on with that person that they're not able to help me in this way, or that they're doing this thing that I don't like? And I want to try to listen to them and be compassionate towards them, and I want to help them to be in a good place. Similarly, if you're dealing with other people, and other people accuse you of being selfish, and, uh, selfish or like self-centered, try to disregard that message, and try to think about it critically, and ask like, what do I really want here? Like, because when I, when I ask myself that question, often my answer is that I want to take care of myself so that I can help others. Because I think I'm inherently generous, but at the same time, if I'm not in a good place, I think it's really important for me to take care of myself and do whatever I need to do to get back into a good place. Uh, kind of like the oxygen mask analogy, because if I don't care, take care of myself, a lot of bad things could happen. Like, I've noticed I'm more likely to lose my temper at people when I'm not taking care of myself. I'm more likely to botch things, to make mistakes, and those mistakes can be harmful or costly to other people. So, there are a lot of different ways things can go wrong when we're not taking care of ourselves. So, I hope that 
I've questioned the idea of selfishness for you, and I hope that you will encourage others to question it as well. I would love to hear from you, so please comment if you like what I have to say, if you have something to add, something you disagree with, and if you like my videos, please share, uh, share them with others, and please consider subscribing to my channel. I love it when people subscribe. Thank you.